Welcome Finksters. Now this is going to be a very short video where I'm going to address an issue that has been asked again and again by programmers. Suppose you have created a new project and when you execute a file within the project, it gets executed in the terminal. For example, if you have a look on the screen, then we have a hello world program within our project which goes by the name Python project one. Now when you go ahead and execute this program, as you can see on the bottom half of the screen that the program gets executed inside the run terminal. But this is not what you want. You might be more comfortable with the IPython console and you want to execute your program within the IPython console. So how can you do that within PyCharm? So that's what we are going to see in this video. Now in order to run your program within the IPython console inside PyCharm, you only have to make a couple of changes and you will be able to run it within the IPython console. So let us quickly go ahead and have a look at these settings. The first setting that you have to configure is you have to click on file and then click on settings. Now you can also use the shortcut keys Control Alt and S and that will open up the settings dialog box for you. Now within this dialog box, you have to select or you have to maximize the build execution and deployment option. And from the drop down options that appear, you have to select console. As soon as you do that, you can see that on the right hand side of this window, you have a few options for general settings. Now in these general settings, make sure that you select use IPython if available and then go ahead and click on OK. You also have to make another adjustment to your settings. To do that, click on run and from the drop down menu that appears, click on edit configurations. As soon as you do that, you can see that the run debug configurations window appears on the screen. Go ahead and select your file which is hello world in our case and make sure that from the options that are available on the right hand side of this window, you move on to execution and within this option, you get another checkbox which says run with Python console. So select this option and click on OK. And now my friends, you have successfully configured all the settings that are needed to execute your program within the IPython console inside PyCharm. So let's go ahead and have a look if this works for us now. So let's execute our code. And there we go. As you can see, the output is now displayed within the IPython console. Now to make things more clear, you can go ahead and make a few more changes so that your windows look a little more organized. To do that, right click on the console, select move to and then select right bottom. Now as you can see, our Python console appears on the right hand side of our screen. So let us go ahead and close this. And as you can see, on the right bottom corner of your screen, you'll find the option for your IPython console. Go ahead and click it. And as you can see, the console reappears once again. Now let's try and make a few more changes and see if this works for us. So I'm going to add another line, print, hello Finkster, enter. And as you can see, we have the required output in the IPython console itself. Now let's move on to our coding space or our coding window and let's print hi. And now we want to execute only this line of code. You can easily do this with the help of shortcut keys. So the shortcut keys that are going to help us to execute a single line of code are Alt, Shift and E. So all you have to do is select the line of code that you want to execute and then press Alt, Shift and E on your keyboard. And as you can see, we have successfully printed or executed the line of code that we wanted. Let's have a look at another example. Let's print the result of 2 plus 5. Now let's go ahead and select this line and now let's use our shortcut keys Alt, Shift and E and there we go. We have successfully printed our result. So that's how easy it was. 
Now this was a very short and quick tutorial. However, this is one of the most frequently asked question, especially by people who are starting to work in PyCharm. And it is always good to know the various options that you have at your disposal within PyCharm. Now, for some reason, if you do not want to use this IPython console, then all you have to do is go ahead and reverse the changes that you made previously. So to do that, you have to click on file, move on to settings, select build execution deployment, then select console and uncheck use IPython if available and then click on OK. Then go ahead and click on run, select edit configurations and then move on to the execution option. And within this, unselect run with Python console and click on OK. Now let's check if this works. So let's execute our code. And as you can see, we have now executed our code within the normal run terminal. So I hope this helps. And if you have any doubts, please mention them in the comments. Now the entire steps that have been followed in this lecture have been provided in an article. I'll provide the link to that article in the description below. Please feel free to go ahead and have a look at that article. That's all for this lecture. Thank you.